Hi dear friends, wish you health, happiness and blue sky and in this short video I want to clarify the difference between do and make. Many people confuse it, but watch this video till the end and you'll be aware of the difference between these two verbs. But before you start watching this video, make sure that you have subscribed to this channel and share it in your social media. Okay, let's start from do. We use do mostly in three ways. The first one with some job, work, or tasks, or homework, and so on. Uh, like we say, do your homework, do your task, uh, like do your test, do these exercises. So, something that relates to work, job, tasks, homeworks, and so on. Secondly, we use do when we want to substitute a verb. For example, I say, I have to do something with my hair. So, I don't say what I'm going exactly to do with my hair. I don't say that whether I'm going to dye it or whether I'm going to cut it. I just say that I'm going to do something. We use do when the meaning is obvious, like I have to do uh, dishes means that I have to wash them, of course. Uh, it's clear, it's obvious, uh, I'm not going to break them, I just need to wash them. And we use uh, do when we uh, just mean some activity, like don't lie on this sofa, just do something, like work, do something, do something with your stuff, I don't know, wash, clean, uh, clean your house, like uh, don't be lazy, for example, do something, or like um, can I do something for you, it means that can I do any activity to help you. And let's go to make. As I've told, we use make when we want to produce, to create something. Uh, we can create some action or activity, like, uh, or we can create some reaction, like I can make you happy or I can make you cry. Uh, here I mean that I can make some reaction. Uh, then we use make when we mean something like making some specific noise or uh, make, making some sounds, making some uh, speaking, like you can say make comments or make a noise. And we use make when we relate to food, drink and so on, like we can say uh, can I pre prepare a cake for you, uh, can I make a cake for you, or can I uh, make a cocktail for you and so on. But instead of uh, make a cake, we ca you can say just, no, don't make this, I'll do this. So, you just substitute your activity with the verb do. That's easy. By the way, you can use do uh, especially with some household chores, like do household chores, uh, I don't know, do my dish, you can also say do gardening, and so on. Well, I hope in this short video you can easily understand the main difference between do and make, main difference, because actually um, in many words and word expressions you just need to remember them. There are no rules regarding do and make, just remember them and um, try to make yourself adapted to these uh, collocations, adapted to these uh, words, word expressions, because um, they don't have any meaning, like uh, they don't have any explanation why in this case we use do and in that case we use make. Just remember them and I hope you like this video, don't forget to subscribe to this channel and share this video. Thank you for watching, see you soon!